m and has been a massive part of your life, sadly losing your dad to the disease. It was great to see people come together for Rob, and he's got a real fight on his hands, but there has been breakthroughs recently with, obviously, within diagnosing the disease, understanding the reason why it happens. Yeah, look, it's, um, it is, it's tragic, isn't it? Um, you know, and, and as I touched on what Jones has said, um, in times of need, the game really does come together. We do, you know, the tribalism and whatever is just completely out the window. Um, and, um, you know, it's a great quality we have in the game. And, and just like we are going to do for Rob, uh, like globally, we'll come together and we'll support him because that's what he's going to need. Um, you know, I, what, what made me sad is uh, knowing the fight that he's got on his hands. I've, I've been through it. We've been through it as a family uh, 13 years ago now. Um, you know, so they've, they've got a challenge in front of them, but yeah, you know, you can't be, um, you can't take it for granted the support that that's, that's been shown to him already. And uh, you know, Rob will be overwhelmed, and, and and his family will be. But you know, the the most important thing if, for them is just some spend some quality time together and uh, and do what they, they want to do together because um, you know it's it's a, it's a it's a tragic disease. It really is. But uh, the more research and the more knowledge we can get out there and. Uh, I, I understand he's, um, yeah, he's, Rob's got a clinical trial starting soon, which is fantastic. Um, you know, but the, I guess as, as a community, all we can do is support him and, and be there when he needs. And uh, certainly, I know we'll do that as a, as a rugby league community.